Hi, right, welcome back to the Club 3G channel. I'm going to show you how to fix the water leaks that are in your car. So I put together a little something. First you'll need to move the battery and tray. Second, lift up the firewall soundproof material. Third, install the rubber washer and then the rubber grommet. Next, make sure the rubber grommet is flush against the evaporator drain tube. That's it, put everything back together. So, here's the parts you'll need. First, you'll need a 2 and 3 fourths or 5 eighths rubber washer, 1 eighths inches thick. It's around $1.26. Next, one rubber grommet, 9 by 32 thickness. Groove diameter, 3 fourths. Groove width, 332. That's 85 cents. So you can Google this on your computer or you can go to the store. So basically you're just removing this part and then at the very back lift up that soundproof material and you'll see a drain tube right in the middle way back dripping if you turn on your AC you'll see it dripping that's the first part second part will be uh, it's actually a wiring, wiring harness that goes in the firewall from the side of the car into the, the cabin so you'll have to remove this headlight these bolts here have to be removed and what you have to do is get some uh, gasket looks like this right stuff gray Use it for water pumps, transmissions. It clears in about five minutes. So what you'll do is, once you get to the wiring harness, is just use this and squirt it around as much as you can to seal the water. Now let's look around. I'll try and show you where it's at. This is what you don't want. You don't want that in your car. So let's look inside. I'll show you where it's at. Okay, inside. see right here I have some uh, gasket already around there it is there's the wiring harness and just gasket around as much as you can and then Water be gone out of your cabin. So, thank you for watching.